Okay, we are looking at 6.1.8, and we want to prove this right here. So first thing we do is the distributive property. So we're distributing A across all this, and then, and then also B across all this too. And that's what we get here below and then we distribute this across all this and this across all this that's why we use the distributive property twice and then we need to use the commutivity property so that we have identical versions so right here we have a negative bab but we want this to be negative ab squared what we get here so that we can cancel it out with this positive ab squared all right so we use the distributive uh commutivity property twice there and then, um, well, we use it all in one go, but all right. So then uh, we use the additive inverse. So these are going to cancel and create zero. Then the additive identity, anything plus zero is that same thing. So a cubed plus zero, well, that is uh, a cubed and zero minus b cubed. That's negative b cubed. All right. Oh. Also, you can run this backwards and uh, you can prove it the other direction too.